Good afternoon, micro followers, and welcome to part two of canning your homemade spaghetti sauce. You're going to need lemon juice, six pint jars, a funnel, a stick blender, a ladle, and your jar grabber. Make sure your canner is filled halfway full of water and go ahead and get that started. In the meantime, we're going to use a stick blender and we're going to get this sauce blended up to where it's nice and smooth. We like our spaghetti sauce nice and smooth only because we have young kids in the house and they don't really care for the big chunks of onion or green pepper. So blend if you like and don't if you don't. Now using your grabber, you're gonna take out one of your jars and you're gonna add a teaspoon of lemon juice. Using your funnel and your ladle, you're going to ladle in your hot sauce into your hot jar until you have one inch headspace. Now I don't have a deal bubbler, so I usually just tap it on the counter a couple times and then I give it a good twisty twist like this. Now you're gonna wipe your jar down with vinegar and apply your lids and rings. Using your grabber, you're gonna put that into your canner and wash, rinse, repeat for the remaining five jars. Now when you're water bath canning, you wanna make sure that your water level is about two inches above your jars. For me, it's right there where that little screw's at for the handle. And if you're using a pressure canner like I am, you wanna make sure that you take out the rubber ring that's on the inside of the lid. Just set it off to the side till the next time. You want a loose fit on your canner. So I just put mine on, give it a little jiggle to make sure it's loose, and go ahead and shut it. Do not put the weight on. You're going to water bath can that for 40 minutes, and then very carefully using your grabber, you're gonna remove each jar and set them on the counter to sit for 24 hours. Do not touch. But after that, open those bad boys up and enjoy. Thanks for watching everybody. For more great recipes, you can visit the website at www.missionmarket.org. And as always, I love you guys. Have a great one.